Hi guys, it's me Lisa. Um, I just thought I'd give you a quick um, video of my altar that I am decorating for Beltane. Um, it hasn't actually, I haven't actually finished the um, altar yet. Um, I haven't actually finished the altar yet. I just thought I'd show you a quick version of how, I, how I'm doing it, but I've got to put like flowers on it and I'm, I'm going to make a maypole as well. So here is it, here it is so far. Um, I have obviously the, uh, the greens and purples. Um, this is my Beltane altar for, for now. My coal, my little thing to burn for the Beltane fire. Um, I'm going to, this is my, I'm going to use this as an offering, um, pot or something and put some stuff into it. Um, I've put fairies on it, um, because I love the fairy realm. Um, yeah, this is just a quick show of my Beltane altar so far. Um, like with Beltane, you want to put yellows, greens, purples, um, stuff like that, so... I'm going to actually make a maple um, and put the maple here, stood here, and I'm going to get some daffodils soon. Um, I know it just looks like a basic altar because I like my altar's basic. I don't want them piled up with loads of loads of statues and sticks and everything all over the place. I like to keep it basic so I know what I'm doing. So yeah, I'm using. Um, um, greens, like the green candles I'm using for greens because it's springtime and stuff. Um, the purples um, I'm using as well. Obviously the yellow for the elemental candle. I'm going to um, get some daffodils and put them on the altar soon. Um, I'm going to use a rose incense stick. I'm going to put um, maybe some honey... Or some oats in this. Um, I'm good. This is my chalice. It's got water in it at the moment. But when I'm going to do my um, ritual, I'm going to put some juice in it, um, like pomegranate juice or something. Um, but yes, this is. I haven't got a cauldron, so I've got this little pot here, and I've got my um, what is it? Charcoal disc inside of it, and I'm going to burn some sage on that. Sage along with the rose incense for my Beltane thing. So yeah. Um, I'm going to make a, um, what did I say I'm going to make again? A maypole to put it in. What I'm going to use is like a, maybe a cereal box for the bottom bit. It's pretty easy really. Then a stick and in the middle, like, see it's like this. It's like something like that stuck up like that. And then it'll have um, ribbons coming off it and maybe flowers around the front of the maypole and a ribbon at the top. So that's what I'm going to do. So I will get back to you soon, maybe next week, and show you my fully updated altar for Belton. Yay! Anywho, yeah. <laughs> I'm decorating my altar for Belton now. Um, well, it is 13th of April, but um, and it's not till May the 1st. But I like to decorate my altars early. So yeah, I've got the greens, the purples, I'm going to get the yellows on it soon, with, obviously with the um, daffodils and so on and so forth. And I'm going to get, yay, I'm going to make the maypole and maybe next week, uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, maybe Tuesday or Thursday or something like that, I'll redo a video and show you my updated version of my Beltane altar. So this is just a basic Beltane altar, I like to keep it simple like I said. Um, so yeah, I hope you like this and bless it be.